All right, guys, so I am making a 12 month tutu. So I cut my elastic at about 12 and a half inches. And I will leave a chart at the end of the video that you can screenshot or take a picture of. So you will remember the measurements for the different sizes. So this is a 12 month, I cut it 12 and a half. And the waist will be a little smaller. The elastic will stretch as I add the tool to the waistband. And then once we do that, we will stitch these two together, hand sewn. So for those of you who do not have a sewing machine, this is how we'll be doing it. So I've tied my thread through the needle and I'm gonna knot it on this end. Just put in a knot and I'm going to overlap these two pieces, these two ends like that. And I'm just gonna take my thread through if you have a sewing machine, it would be a faster, easier process. But this is the cheaper way. So you won't have to go out and purchase a machine just to make the tutus by hand. So we're gonna thread that all the way. Not sure if you can see that. But I'm just threading through both sides from end to end. And then once we're done with that, you wanna make sure it's secure as well. So once we finish sewing, we'll pull the elastic to make sure that the thread does not come apart because that would not be good. So I'll finish this and then we'll get to the next step. Okay, so this is how it looks once I've threaded it. And as you can see, it's very secure. So once we finish that, the waistband, we'll take our tool and the tool and the elastic is from Hobby Lobby. Everything can be found at Hobby Lobby and I will post the link below of what I use. I believe I got this cutting board from um, Walmart, but they do have them at Hobby Lobby. Now, since this is a 12 month tutu, I'm cutting it at 17 inches so when it folds over let me fold it this way 17 inches so I just cut one because I want to confuse myself actually we're going to use the rotary tool since we're using the cutting net and once it folds over it's about 8 inches which is a good length for a tutu to flare out on a 12 month old. So I've made thousands of these and maybe probably three customers to say that it was short or something like that. You can ask the customer if the baby's tall or short, but usually the shorter it is, the more that it'll fluff out. You wanna make sure you're adding enough material so that it will be a good fluff at the end so we're going to cut these pieces at 17 inches you can go shorter you can go longer so i'm going to cut these i'm actually going to maybe just use one roll of tool if i need more then i'll add another roll but since this is for a 12 month old their weights are small so you won't need that much Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and cut and I'll show you how to add it to the elastic. So we'll be set up for that in just a few. So this is my little mannequin I purchased from eBay and that was probably almost 10 years ago. But as you can see, it lasts a very long time. I will post a link for this as well and you can also order one off of Amazon and I will be sure to leave all links below in the description box. So adding the tool, this is one piece that I have. You will be adding it piece by piece, but once you get it, I promise you can be done with this in about 15 minutes. So we're gonna take this, fold it in half, 
make a little loop pull out your elastic and take it under like that open and you're going to pull this through the center so then it'll come out like this and pull it tight and there you have it so the more that we add the more fluff that we'll get so you're going to repeat that step with the rest of the pieces like that and that thread is going to cover as I get around so like and I, I just pull out this to get under so you're going to go under make a loop go in between and pull like so so as you can see it start the fluff is starting to come up the more that we add and we will keep going so i'm gonna do a few more pieces and then i'm going to go ahead and show you the finished product and it's super easy you guys you can do this in any color any size so again under make the loop through the hole and pull all right so i'm gonna go ahead and finish this and i'll show you the finished product and then i'll be sure to add a chart at the end if you do not have a mannequin you can also put the tool around a paper towel or even around your thigh or leg or something depending on what size you make it but yep this is how we start off making the tutu and i'm gonna go ahead and finish up it's the same step all the way around and then we'll go from there all right we are now at the finished product of the 12 month tutu so this is how it looks once we have completed the entire thing all the way around it is very fluffy i used one roll of tool then i had i actually used yeah i used one roll and then from the second roll i had to cut about 10 pieces to fill the front so that's how it looks once we are done and you just fluff it out like so and this can be done in any color any size and i'll leave a size chart for those who will need additional help making different sizes. All right, you guys, don't forget to like and subscribe. I hope this was easy for you who've always, who's always wanted to make a tutu. So just leave a comment. Don't forget to thumbs up.